Well, hello there, my friends. How are you? Charles here. With a slight sore throat. Uh, every year this time, I get a sore throat, and I don't know why. My glands are puffed up. Yesterday, I canceled all my obligations. Today, I canceled all my obligations, with the exception of a haircut. I'm getting my hair cut because I look horrible. <laughs> Uh, but anyway, today is Christmas Eve. So firstly, for all of you out there uh, who celebrate Christmas on December 25th, the Catholics, the, um, the Protestants, and some Orthodox Christians around the world, uh, happy Christmas Eve to you. Christmas Eve is actually the evening before, right? But I consider the whole day before Christmas. December 24th is Christmas Eve. Uh, this will be my... Uh, 11th Christmas away from family, uh, which isn't easy, but it's expensive for me to fly over for a little bit and come back. Uh, and my family doesn't really, we don't have big celebrations for Christmas because we have many different faiths in our family. Um, so anyway, to all of you, happy Christmas Eve. Here in Serbia, Badnedan is the day before Christmas, and that's January 6th for Serbian Orthodox Christians and some other Orthodox who follow that calendar. And January 7th is Christ, uh, Christmas for Serbians. Um, but anyway, l let me show... Well, you know what? I'll show you at the end of the video. This is what I thought was so ridiculous, okay? When I was in Stockholm, Sweden, my buddy, uh, Urosh, he, he messaged me. And he said, man, did you see it's supposed to be extremely cold here in Serbia? Uh, right after Sveti Nikola Slava, which is December 19th, there was an article. He said it was supposed to be like negative 20 Celsius or negative 25 Celsius, something like that, which is like negative 10-ish Fahrenheit, which is cold, bitterly cold. They said the last time it was this cold was uh, like December uh, or in 2012, I remember 2012, I was living in Zrenjanin, and that was a bitterly cold winter. I was teaching at a couple schools, and snow was deep, it was bitterly cold. Man, that was a rough winter. Uh, and that was the last time it's really been cold here. Ever since that point, I don't remember a bad winter here, you know? It's been relatively mild. Uh, but anyway, I'm in Sweden, and it was fairly warm, and he's telling me, man, it's going to be cold in Serbia. I was like, oh, shit. I don't want that. I Google it. I found a, an article in B92, okay? If you want to read Serbian um, news, and you don't want to read it in Chitalitsa or Latinitsa, you can read B92 in English language. I mean, it's it's media, okay? It's, uh, I'll just let you determine what you think of it. But anyway, it's got some interesting articles and it's in English language. Anyway, there's an article in here. It says the Serbian winter in Serbia or the Siberian winter in Serbia starts from Sveti Nicholas. It says a cold wave arrives in Serbia. Very low temperatures and icy days are waiting for us with temperatures below zero for days. It says meteorologists warn uh, temperatures in some places could drop to negative 25. Um, heavier snow will fall again after December 25th, and it will be the same for New Year's. Emergency situations have already been declared in Ivanica, Guccia, Sienica, uh, Krupan, Lucheni, Ljubovia, and Novovaros. Novovaros. Due to snow. There's going to be emergencies in a dozen municipalities, blah, 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 blah. But anyway, they're saying it's going to be ungodly cold. Falling snow, freezing cold, okay? Listen to this, okay? So I read that when I was in Stockholm. I'm like, oh, shit. <clears throat> I get back here. For example, today, it is 57 degrees Fahrenheit outside today. The day before Christmas, okay, 57 in, in Celsius is, does it say on my phone? No, but that's roughly 11 degrees Celsius. Okay, that's hot. I mean, that's beautiful. That's a nice spring day. And the rest of the week, it's going to be tomorrow for Christmas. 
57 Fahrenheit, Saturday, or sorry, 52 tomorrow, 48 Sunday, 43, 46, 45, 48, close to 50 degrees, close to 10 degrees Celsius. Okay, that tells you uh, all this, this shit you read in the media and stuff is so hyped up. It's like, how do you believe anything anymore? You know, let me just show you outside. I'll show you really quickly. We will show you what's going on here. Okay.